Hello, and welcome to Little Nightmares. This is a game I found on Steam. It looks a lot like Limbo that I played on the Xbox 360, I think way back in 2011. I love puzzly games. This one's very creepy, so it's a good choice for October. Opening scene here. I kind of gave up on Subnautica for a while when I played creative mode. You kind of spoiled it for me because I figured out how to get out of there based on what I saw in creative mode. And I will go back to it at some point, but... Other games I was looking at... Oh, so creepy. So here you are. Here's your main character here. Just this little kid. This isn't Limbo. I don't know what it is. So... Left, right, forward, and back. So you have... True 3D in it. But it's very puzzly. Limbo was one of my favorite games, all-time games. Side-scrolling. Very creepy. This is horror. Other favorite game along these lines... Another favorite game along these lines is Portal, and Portal 2 that I played a lot of. I thought about for the holiday... for the... The season for Halloween type games, I thought about playing Seven Days to Die, Crafting Survival, and uh, Zombie Game. But I decided I'd had enough crafting with Subnautica. And the other one I was thinking about doing was Phasmophobia, which looked really good, but that would have required multiplayer and until somebody says they want to play that with me. I want to stay in the game anyway. Do these games. I don't think anybody else wants to stay up until 4 o'clock in the morning like I do. But. It's a good time to do it. It's rainy out. It's really rainy out. Got the garden fairly well taken care of, although some things blew over today in the wind. Spent two days this week replanting hostas. Which, one of which was probably 60, 70 pounds. It's a very big plant. Duck. I think this game would be a lot better with a controller. I may get a Xbox controller for the PC. I'm playing it on the PC. Okay, so... I've already played through this, but I wanted to do it again. Oh, I'm gonna... To bounce... Bounce... Bounce at the right time, there we go. I have to say, this is probably a lot harder than Limbo, and a lot creepier, too. You jump, you gotta move and jump and grab. A lot in this game. Right 
right here is a thing that'll fall down and get you. Careful. Maybe not in here. Um, okay, I already know how to do this stuff, so. Those creepy things. Definitely limbo esque. Uh, I know they made a new one called Outside, but I kind of got that ruined for me too. So I just happened to see the highlights that the Game Grumps did on it. of fun little puzzles. I already figured these out. Jump here. Come on. Jump. I want you to jump. So I don't remember if this is a timed one, but it probably is. Strong little thing. It's quite. I think it's a girl. I don't know. I'm not seeing what it is. It's a girl or a boy or not. Okay. This is the one I hate. Uh, I've messed this up so many times. I probably will again. Oh, no, 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 no. Dang it. I made a mistake, I hit the, the light button. Okay. Come on, move. Yeah. Ah. So close. I would be a lot better at this with the, the next box controller. Oh my god. It's like stuck there. Creepy. Dang, man, they don't give you any leeway there. Boy. Oh, I jumped right into it. <laughs> so I have to jump, and then I have to move over to one side, and then probably jump again. Just a little bit more. Dang, you go that way, and that one gets you. Well, I'm going to get through this, and then I'm going to 